it's it's just it's mace essentially. So if you ever think if you think of what mace would be, um, even in a small amount, that would be kind of the experience that you're dealing with here. Avert your eyes, people. <laughs> this could be deadly. Oh, oh. All right, we're good. We're good. Capsaicin is ethanol uh, soluble, it's alcohol soluble, so it'll be cast into the liquid and then when we puree it more <coughs> surface area, we'll, we'll come in contact with the liquid, hopefully drawing up the most that we can get. And ultimately we filter this off and take that liquid, reduce it, we should be left with a, a nice bit of oil. You can start smelling it at this point, it feels quite potent. If it becomes uh, if it becomes abrasive in your nose, you'll notice it first, or in your in your lungs. Just step out, alert someone, be like, "Hey, I think we're I think we're you know, like gassing ourselves. We should leave. Let it all go. We should be getting a good amount of liquid down the bottom. To separate it, we're boiling off the ethanol and the water, and what should remain is simply the uh, the capsaicin oil, um, and it will become brick red. There are sugars in the liquid, and if they get too hot, they'll caramelize. That's bad on two parts, um, because it makes it more sweet. It's like, ooh, tasty, as opposed to, ooh, pain. And, uh, and also, the burning uh, sends capsaicin into the air, which is not good. It's thick. Oh my god. Oh. So innocuous looking. <laughs> 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 Like, just oh, that's interesting. <laughs> <laughs> it tastes like vanilla for the first like five seconds, and then uh, back your throat starts burning as it goes down. No, 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 no. Oh my God. You should do it next time. It's good. It tastes like vanilla, and then it's like. Like an atomic fireball. Whoa! <laughs> <laughs>